welcome back to Kid Friendly Videos and the first thing I want to do is wish everybody a happy new year for 2018. This is our first video this year and hopefully it'll be one of at least 300 videos we'll make this year and we're making them based on the Pixar Cars movies, Cars 1, 2 and 3. We're taking cars from Cars movies and we're converting them into something else. Like right now we have a whole bunch of blue cars here. These are all tributes to fabulous Doc Hudson Hornet. This car inspired us to make all these other cars here. Here's, um, for example, this is Fabulous Chick Hicks, from, made from uh, Chick Hicks, actually. And this is actually um, Fabulous Jackson Storm, with igniter on the hood and red wheels. And we have Fabulous Cruise and Mirrors, number 51, with silver wheels, we didn't paint them yet. And Fabulous Sheriff, that was somebody's idea. I forget who it is now, but thanks for suggesting it. Appreciate that. And all the other ones here look fabulous. Luigi and Guido. Fabulous Flo, who would have thought of that, you know? And Fabulous the King, and look at this. Fabulous Thomas the Train. And our most famous of all, like the famous reindeer. Uh, this is actually the School Bus of Doom, Miss Fritter. We have the original Miss Fritter back here, still in the package. Don't worry, kids, we still have the car. And we're gonna maybe someday do something with it. I don't know yet, we haven't decided. And there's the Fabulous School Bus of Doom, Miss Fritter. It was awesome. And we do all kinds of stuff. Like, here's an example. This is actually a Chester Whipple filter homemade version. This is actually sand on top, painted perfectly. And this is one we made as a, as a, as kind of like a fun thing. This is actually um, Jackson Storm with his own number, 5.0 instead of 2.0. It's upside down backwards, 2.0, it's 5.0. And it's covered with glitter. It's Glitter Storm. That's, that video is very popular right now. And let's see, we have over here um, the car that started it all from Cars 3. If you watch Cars 3, I know you saw it. Most of you did, some didn't. In the movie, there was a scene where Lightning McQueen was only painted primer gray right after his big crash. Remember the big crash he got in Cars 3? He ended up like going through the air, flying, and all of a sudden he landed upside down and back on his feet. And then he got fixed up, he was in the garage when we next saw him, and he was painted primer gray. And I said, wow, we gotta get that car. And over here we have all kinds of other crazy things, like this is actually Mater with a Play-Doh covered hood and a different front. Guess who he is? He lost his um, torpedo, but he's actually Pizza Planet truck. Check it out, pretty good, eh? And over here we have all kinds of cars from the uh, Crazy 8 series. Look back here, we have all kinds, oh actually, hang on, this is actually um, Next Gen Lightning McQueen based on Jackson Storm. Um, hit and Run, there's Hit, which one is which? Where's the other guy gone, who knows? But all kinds of cars here are from the Cars Crazy 8 series. We got, that's T-Bone, see the smash, T-Bone. That was actually Daryl Mustang Burger. And um, oh, I forget his name again. It's actually Boot. Um, it's not Rob, but he got a pink color, pink color. And look, Fabulous Mater. He's one of my favorites. He came out perfect. And if you watch the Crazy Eight, look, there's Jimbo. That's another Mater. Listen to this. He's actually die cast Mater. He's beat to pieces. We got a good job making him. And over here, look, it's Fabulous Dusty from Plains. A little bit the wrong color. We can fix that sometime. Woohoo! Look out, Dusty. And over here, we got um, Pushover. That's leakless. And that looks like Cruiser Mirrors as Rainbow Cruiser Mirrors. We have a whole Rainbow series. And Sig Alert. That's Ramon. I did that live stream one day. And let's see. We have Patty. Used to be Sally. And Fair Game, the taxi. We got all kinds of cars here, folks. If this is your first time here. You're going, what the heck's going on here? But we have a, a lot of cars here painted different colors. Like there's a whole rain, Rainbow series and a whole Zebra series. There's Zebra Mater. Uh, zebra the King, Zebra so Miles Axelrod, and everyone's been asking me to do Fabulous Red, and I, there's no way I was going to do Fabulous Red, for one thing, because I only have one red, but I went and bought Fabulous Red at Walmart the other day, and guess what? He's not the same as regular red. I'm going to open it up right now and show you. This is the new red from Cars 3, and here's the original red that I got a long time ago. Now, can you see the difference? Obviously, one's way bigger. The guy on the right, the new guy, is bigger. And he's got um, different size tires. Everything's different about him. Even, does this go up? No, that doesn't go up either. Okay, so they're the same that way. But I'm not gonna paint, never gonna touch the original. This is the original red, I would never touch him. He's my favorite. I will paint him favorite red in honor of Doc Hudson pretty soon. Not today, though. I might save it for the weekend when there's lots of viewers. But today, we're gonna look at something different here. Watch this here, put that over to the side there. Um, somebody sent me a, a request to do Darren Leadfoot from Miguel Camino. Actually, somebody else sent me a request to do Tim Treadless, and I printed him off. And someone else, 
begged me to do. Chris Revstopsky. I can do that easily. I just got to find the right truck for it, but I'm not doing that today, folks. So I'm gonna put that over here. I'm gonna put that over here. And I'm gonna start right here with the um, Miguel Camino. Looks a bit different than that car, but I'm gonna prime it gray and paint it green with shiny wax 82. This is Darren Ledfoot. So I forget your name who asked for it. I'm gonna do that tonight. So um, just uh, let me get the paint out and we'll start painting the primer gray. Okay, we got the paint thing out there and we're gonna put some gray right here. Like we always do the same place every time for no reason. And um, Miguel Camino is one of the cars from Cars 2. It's actually one of the World Grand Prix races. Now I've got a lot of World Grand Prix races. I'm not worried about one Miguel Camino. I got two or three Miguels. I, I got one still in the package actually brand spanking new. I'm not gonna worry about that, but I wanna make this here car look like the Darren Leadfoot from Cars 3, I guess. I, I missed a whole bunch of cars. Uh, you guys were watching the video game, I guess. I didn't watch, I didn't get the video game, I only watched the movie, so I kinda missed uh, many of the cars that are out there. I never heard of before, and you guys are requesting them, and I don't know if they are, like a whole bunch of new ones. But I hope you guys had a happy new year, and I hope you had a good time wherever you live. And uh, if you're watching this video now, go to the comment section and put in a comment where you live. I get people from all over the world watching these videos and I'm really happy that you guys are watching them. To me it's really nice because uh, I get to entertain a whole generation of people over around the world. It's great. And thanks again everybody for leaving the comments and suggestions. If it wasn't for suggestions I wouldn't know what to do. Sometimes I would say, what am I going to do? It? So I read the comments and there's an idea right there. Make Darren Ledfoot from Miguel Camino. I got lots of, lots of suggestions. Uh, one guy said make another car look like Guido today. I said, how do you make a car look like Guido? He's only like the pit stop, pit stop. That'll be hard to do. And this, like I said, is my first video this year, 2018. I hope to have at least 300 up this year. That'll bring me a total of 2,700 videos on YouTube. I hope YouTube will discover my channel someday and make them really popular. Trying our best to make everybody happy. And make sure our videos are all family friendly, kid friendly, no bad words, no bad anything. Our videos are very clean and very good. And we're hoping, um, we're hoping that you guys like them too. And I, obviously you do because you keep going back to watch more. Okay, there is Primer Miguel Camino for the first time in Pixar Cars history. You're going to see Primer Miguel Camino. I'm hoping someday you can buy these cars in the store with paint on them, you know, with paint so you can make your own. Creations. This is like my idea here to paint all different colors. But anyway, this is a primer Miguel Camino. Come back in a few minutes time and we'll start putting the green paint on them. I'm gonna paint them that color green and then put shiny wax 82 and it's Darren Redfoot. Okay, we're back folks. We have Miguel Camino. He's now primer Miguel Camino. And I have three different color greens here. We have um, actually um, one, two, three. And I think the one that matches the most of uh, most of the car is this one way back here. I'll paint the whole car this color green and then I'll, oh yeah, that's nice. Two color, two coats of this green. Then I'll put some dark green on the bottom and some neon green on the top. So let's put lots of this green on here, two coats. And I'll put a, actually come back later and put a, some sort of a smile on his face. Not much of a smile, it's more of like a, a grill, a black grill across the front there. See, it's shiny wax, number 82, Darren Leadfoot. And I hope this is uh, exactly what um, you want it, whoever it was that requested it. I know if I looked it up, I'd find your name, but I, I'm re no, I can't do it right now, obviously. But say it was me when you get the when you see the video. Say it was me that suggested it. Okay, so I'll know who it was. Thanks very much. Anyway, it's going pretty good. I hope you guys had a good Christmas, and if you got some special presents, put a put a message in the comment section saying I got this for Christmas, and I'll know what it is. Thanks very much. And uh, I'll tell you what I got. I got I got this right here. Look. Giant Miss Fritter Demo Derby. 10 sounds. Okay, I did, I'm not gonna open that today. I'll open that another time. But that is huge. Look, I'm gonna zoom back so you can see it. Check it out. Huge Miss Fritter. I can't wait to open it up and show you what it, show you what it does. And I actually have to paint the wheels black because uh, Darren Ledfoot has black wheels, as you can see. And I paint the wheels black. I have black paint already to go here. See it? And I'll finish this off first. This paint is drying really fast because I have, um, oops, wrong paint. Wrong paint. See that? neon green, wrong one. It's drying really fast because I have uh, the heat lamp on over there, the homemade paint dryer for the cars. Just a light bulb sitting above the um, car, sitting on four bottles of Play-Doh, I'll be honest with you. And it dries really fast. Okay, there we go. 
And like I said, keep sending your comments in, guys. I really read them all the time. As you know, I read them because I always comment on them. 99% of the time I comment on them. If I don't get a chance, sometimes I miss some. Sorry about that. And usually the video is good for one day and then disappears. That's the problem with the YouTube's algorithm. I get one day of a video and then disappears. No one watches anymore. I mean, not that. It's because uh, the algorithm doesn't send it to everybody. It only sends it to the first day and then disappears. So if you're watching this video, the day after New Year's, which is January the 3rd, well, actually two days after January the 3rd, two days past New Year's, then you're only going to see it because it won't be on after that there, it'll disappear. Okay, I'm going to leave um, this here eyebrows is black on Darren Leadfoot, see it? And the bottom of the car is black right here, and the windows are blacked out, so I'll do all them in black, and the wheels are black. I can do some of the wheels right now, actually. I have another brush right here. I'll do the wheels in black. The black right here. Oh, it's going to be really cool doing that. That's easy. Someone suggested I blow on the wheels I got there. That way the paint goes right through the um, serrations in the wheel so you can see them better. See, that's all full of it now. And now, it's perfect. I'll do the other wheels when this, actually I could probably do it right now, actually. I'll hold it right here. It's, it's, it's still warm from the heat lamp, so I can still uh, paint the wheels and hold it at the same time. Perfect. And see how fast it dries? Nothing to it. Here we go, folks. This is doing really good, Darren Leadfoot. Okay, now I think I can uh, grab a small brush, one of these small ones here, and do the, um, here it is, do the eyebrows and the eyes in black right now, very carefully. That's the hardest part, of course. Yeah, what do you think of that? I, I can probably do the windows too because I didn't do them yet either. Do them in black right now too. There's only one window on this car on the side. Miguel Camino was not the same as Darren Leadfoot. So we're going to do it anyway. In the back window? Oh jeez, it's gone. It's covered completely in paint. I'll have to do this window first. I think I'll come back and do the back window first because that's still wet. So we'll wait a little while for that. Okay, we'll leave this dry. Hang on, I missed a spot right here. Missed a spot with the green right here. In here. We'll leave this dry and we'll come back and we'll put on some neon green and some other color green. There we go. Let this sit for a few minutes and we'll come right back. First coat looks pretty good, folks. Okay, folks, we're back here again. We're going to touch up around the eyes a little bit. I kind of like a lot of black covered most of the eyes there, so I'm just going to cover that up a little bit like this here so it looks more like the picture. I'll try and get the second coat on because this is going on really nice. That looks a lot better. A lot less sloppy, I should say. And the car is still warm because it took it off the heat lamp, so it's really warm. It'll dry really fast. It won't be very long before it dries completely. And then I'll put on the number 82 on the doors. And actually, I want to put some dark green on too because this car's got like three different color paints on it. So I'll do that next. I'm going to put the second coat on first to make sure it's totally covered. Look, I missed the mirror last time. How do I do that? Uh, okay, we'll see if we can get this done right. The second coat goes on way better. It's covering it completely nice. We'll do the back window in black too, right? I got a chance now. I won't touch it this time. And I'll fix that tire. Put some black on it real quick. There we go. I hope you guys are making your own uh, your own creations too. I think I mentioned before, if you if you make a video or make do a car, paint it up, and give me a link or send me a picture, I'll put it on my page or my video. Actually, so everyone can see it. My videos aren't that great. These these uh, cars are not that good. I know that because uh, I saw other people doing them and they do a way better job. And I'm the first to admit that. So if you want to send me a picture of what you have, um, what cars you've done, I will definitely put it up there and show the world. We get a lot of subscribers, a lot of views. We get probably 10,000 views every video. Our most popular one was Miss Fritter, 30,000 views in two days. That's why I love doing this, folks. Lots of views. And you guys like watching them. And share with your friends, please. And hit the like button. I'm gonna do that black right now so I can do that back window so it's completely finished. I can tell it's dark by the picture. I don't have the real car. I only got one picture of it over there I showed you before. I'll do the outside first and then I'll fill in the inside with black. Nice. 
this is a nice idea. Whoever it was sent that in. Thanks very much for Darren Ledfoot from Miguel Camino's idea. Some of you guys are persistent. You say the same thing all the time, and I get to it eventually. One guy wanted me to do, like I said, a Luigi. I know. Oh my goodness, how can I do? No, Guido, I mean, I forget. Anyway, there is the back window done, and the second coat is finished. Now I'm going to write number 82. On, no, I can't do that yet. I'm going to write, I'm going to put some dark green on the bottom. I'm going to put dark green right here. It'll actually blend pretty good with the paint now because it's half dry. That's pretty good. And over the fender a bit. Same on this side. And over the fender. And just a little stripe across the back here. And let's see, uh, the windshield posts, pillars I mean. Dark green. There we go. And there's kind of a grill across the front. It's a black grill. I'm going to try and do that right now. Right here. Okay, ready? Here goes. There. That's perfect. Okay, now let's see what else we can do. We'll leave this dry for a few minutes. And I'll come back and I'll write number 82 here, here, and the shiny wax on the hood, and see how it looks. Okay, folks, we're back again. We have Darren Ledfoot here, almost done. I'm gonna get some, uh, another brush here, put some neon green on this back quarter panels, and see how that looks. Over along here, it looks like it's neon. I'll show you the picture so you know what I'm talking about. Different color green in the back corners, and possibly on the hood, too, on the roof, too. So we'll try that right here, see how that looks. here and over actually the whole roof is neon we'll do that neon green I don't want to put two coats so I'll do it pretty thick let it dry again really nice okay change hands okay the car is still really warm because it's on the heat lamp that's why it's paint is activated but it's actually working pretty good that's why I like it and go right up along here on this post and just across here, perfect. And on the same thing on the other side. Let's see, it goes right down along here. And along this post. Nice, all right, that's perfect. And I'm gonna do something, I'm gonna do the spoiler in neon green right here. It'll look different than the picture, but uh, I kinda think it belongs here. Okay, nice. Now, number 82 is going to be uh, the uh, number on the engine hood in yellow. Actually, no, it's a shiny wax on the engine hood, sorry. And I'm going to try that in yellow right now. I hope I can do it right, but I'm making a mess. Oh, that came perfect, guys. That's nice. Okay, number 82 on this door in blue. In uh, blue. In yellow, here goes. Be very careful with this here, 82. Nice, that's really nice, guys. Okay, that was looking great. Okay, and on the roof, actually, it's 82 on the, actually, the whole roof. Gee, 82 again. And on the other door, I know it's 82. Getting better at this, folks, all the time. I hope you do your videos and send them in to me. I'll put them up on the screen. Send me your comments. And if you don't like it, don't hit the like button. Just say, that sucks, or that's great. Whatever you think, guys. And you know what? It says shiny wax here. There's no way I'm going to paint shiny wax on the back. So I don't think I can do that. But I think that's it, folks. Here we have Darren Ledfoot from McGall Camino, number 82. And the black wheels, 82 on the side, different color greens and uh, black around the eyes. Looks pretty good. Let's clean the mess up and have a look and see how she looks compared to the rest of the cars. Well folks, there you have Darren Leadfoot printed off the printer from Miguel Camino. And here is the actual Darren Leadfoot from Miguel Camino. That was a good call. That was a really good call. The car looks great. I think I did a pretty good job of that folks. Hit the like button if you like it. And if you don't like it, tell me why I don't like it. I think I did a pretty good job of that there car. It's close, the colors are almost the same. And um, put this right next to the rest of the cars. And see how that looks down here right next to Glitter Storm and Retired Lightning McQueen. 
This is Lightning with no stickers on it. See, him? he's retired from racing. I guess they're selling his merchandise now. And again, folks, thanks very much for the comments and the requests. I can't wait to do this guy here. This is Chris Revstopsky. He's an official pace car, or I mean official race starter. I, I, I can find a flag, no problem. I have to find a truck that'll fit. And this guy here, Tim Treadless, don't worry, I'll get him done too. Uh, not sure. If you can tell me what car to make him from, it'll help me out. What will I use to make Tim Tread? Let's put it in the comment section, and I'll appreciate that. And there's my two reds. All red. The original. I'll never paint all red. He's a, He's been here forever. New red, no problem. Uh, I just got another day at Walmart. They're very cheap. And all the other cars back here. Um, thanks for watching, folks. Leave your ideas and your thoughts and your comments in the comment section, and I will definitely get back to you. And have a great day. Uh -huh.